falling. If you're someone who's afraid of heights, then it's probably best that you skip this video, for what happens in it is pretty terrifying. The video starts off with someone who is wearing a GoPro as he tries his best to walk across a canyon on a tightrope. However, little does he know that walking on it wouldn't be as easy as he thought, for what happens next will make your stomach drop. How scary. Thankfully he was okay. But, had it not been for his parachute, this person would have met his death a bit too soon. What makes this really unsettling is the way this video was shot in, and the uneasiness it induces, especially towards the end where we see him lose his balance. It's the type of feeling you get when you're falling in your dreams. The only difference is that this person experienced this in real life and could have actually died. Thankfully, that didn't happen. A terrifying encounter. This next video comes from a couple who were locked inside their apartment after hearing loud banging noises coming from down the hall. As it turns out, those noises were being made by someone who was wielding a machete and using it to break into people's apartments. With that said, the following clip is a bit unsettling as what you're about to see is just beyond terrifying. He was then shot multiple times upon entering. Although completely locked, the door was surely no match for the machete. But overall, this terrifying encounter must have been really traumatizing. The condition of this disturbed individual is unknown, but because he was shot three times, it's safe to assume that it's critical. Doubtless, the terror caused by this person was not only frightening for the occupants, but also for the viewers. Scary Cult The following video comes from YouTuber Sam and Colby, who go and explore a haunted forest known as the Cobb Estate. However, they would encounter something way more scary than a ghost. The video starts off with Sam and Colby, who are talking about the history of this forest and how it's known for having satanic rituals take place and other creepy things. The following day, they head over to this forest and encounter something really creepy. Here's what happened. So that these other yeah, guys yeah, don't do anything too stupid, okay? Seriously. There's a group of people over there. There's a group? 100%? Multiple people. Should we get out of here? Like, in all honesty? Okay, so the door was open. I, anybody could be in here right now. It's probably just like a grim cold door. Oh. Yo, what the? That sounded like someone getting killed. Are we staying here right now? He just said call 911. Wait, guys, honestly, he just said 911. What? It sounds like the voices are getting closer. 100%. So let's choose a f that girl, go. That girl screamed. They're acting like crazy people and they just said call 911. Okay, what is going just, on? Just keep walking. Let's go up. Let's go up. Go, 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 go,
No, no, they're coming right there. Look at them. Look, they're, they're actually coming. Go, 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 go. This is serious. They're getting close. They're on bikes. They're real close. Go. What is? Wait. There they are. There they are. What the fuck's going on, guys? What is actually going on? They're right there. Guys, can you see those lights? That's them. They're all right there. They're on bike. Let's go. Right when I was saying we were about to approach them. Get in. Get in. Get in the car. What is actually happening? Should we, should we try? Who knows what could have happened had they gone any further into this forest? Luckily, they were close to the entrance, making their escape quick and easy. As for the people that were chasing them, it's unknown if they were a part of some cult. Perhaps it was a couple of people who wanted to scare them just for laughs. It's still a mystery as to why they were chased. Regardless of this group's intentions, it's safe to say that if they were caught, something bad could have happened to them. And this might be so, considering that this place is known for having satanic cults. Of course, let me know what you guys think. Was it just a group of people scaring them just for laughs? Or was it some cult with bad intentions? Let me know in the comments below. Home Invasion This next video is an audio recording of a kid talking to a 911 operator after hearing someone break inside his house. The recording is pretty scary, as the kid on the line tries his best to stay quiet, trying not to alert the person inside. Yet doing so didn't help, for what happens to him will have you on the edge of your seat. Do you hear them in the house? Do you hear them in the house? Where do you hear them? What can you hear them? Okay, don't worry, we have officers on the way. Okay. Do not hang up. If you have to, just don't say anything, but leave the line open, all right? The, the truck that you saw, was it like a full-size truck? Small truck? You hear them coming? Okay, hold on one moment. We have officers almost there. And you hear two of them in the room with you? Okay, have they noticed any police officers out front or have they said anything? Okay. Okay. Does your closet door have a lock on it where you can lock yourself in if need be? No, no, okay. no, 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 no. All right. Do you have any older brothers or sisters that should, are going to be home? Okay. Okay. Just making sure. Please don't hurt me. Did they open the door? Did they open the door and saw you? Okay. Okay. Well, did they leave? Okay. Just stay on the phone with me. The officer, see him. Do not hang up. You stay on the phone with me, okay? Okay. Are you in your bedroom or are you still in the closet? I'm still in the closet. Okay. Okay. The officers do see him. I want you to stay right where you are. I will let you know when the officers what they want you to do, okay? Okay. Just imagine hiding inside your closet, trying your best to not make a sound, and then being found by the stranger who broke inside. Like the kid's reaction, it would make anyone plead for help. But thankfully, whoever the stranger was didn't harm the kid. Videos like these are pretty frightening, as it makes you realize that not even in the comfort of your own home are you safe. That being said, what would you do if someone broke inside your home? Would you call for help? Or... Would you try to defend yourself? What would you do? Something at the door. This next video involves two girls who encounter something really spooky while recording themselves. Someone else's games. Too late for second guessings. Too late to go back to sleep. It's time to trust my instincts. Close my eyes and leap. It's time to try to fucking gravity. I think I
The scariest part isn't the bottle that fell, but the moment the door was wide open. The darkness outside makes you feel unsettled, making you think that something is going to pop out. Our feeling of uneasiness intensifies with every passing second. Now, it could be the case that this is all a hoax, as both the bottle and the door could have been attached to a string. There could have been other ways of faking this video, but it's not certain if this was faked. Whether it's fake or not, there's no doubting that this video is pretty creepy. Creepy Morgue This last video was shot inside a morgue, where two employees saw something really creepy. The video starts off with who appears to be a security guard slowly approaching a door that seems to be slamming on its own. You can tell that both the person filming and the security guard are scared as they're slowly walking towards it. But it's what happens afterwards that's not only way more scary but also baffling. As you can imagine, they must have been baffled by this. This must have led them to believe that this was the work of some poltergeist or some other entity, considering that this happened inside a morgue and that no one was behind this door. That could be the case, but as with most videos on the paranormal, it could be fake. But what do you think? Do you think this could have been faked? Or do you think this was actual footage of paranormal activity caught on camera? Let me know in the comments below.